This is a world of only women, a paradise that men dream of. Every woman here is a warrior. Now, they are going to hold a tournament. The little girl's name is Diana, and she wants to win this race. As soon as the drum started beating, Diana was way ahead. She leapt into the sea to swim as fast as she could to the shore. She mounted a black horse and ran fast, but was accidentally knocked down by leaves. The people behind her were about to catch up with her when she decided to take the shortcut. She slid all the way down and jumped on the horse, and was the first to come to the last hurdle. She picked up the javelin, and was about to complete the final stroke when she was stopped by the examiner. Because Diana had taken a shortcut, which was not allowed in the competition, her heart was full of loss. At that moment her mother came over, she pointed to the golden warrior, and told Diana that if she wanted to become a real warrior, she couldn't rush but had to rely on true bravery. Years passed, Diana came to a colorful world. A sports car is speeding on the verge of hitting the grandmother. At this point, Diana kicked open the sports car to save the grandmother. The robbers held the little girl to throw her down. When a man fell from the sky to save the little girl, immediately after the robber was caught by her, she is Wonder Woman, a hero to maintain world peace. She easily crushed the gun in the hands of the robber. Not waiting for the police to rob the robber has been tied up. Diana works in a museum. This day, Diana and the leopard girl in the inspection of stolen antiques. A strange crystal attracted Diana's attention. With a few words written on it, Place upon the object held but one great wish. At that moment, the bearded man next to him held the crystal and joked about asking for a cup of coffee. He did not expect someone to really send a cup of coffee over. All this they thought was a coincidence. Diana also silently made two wishes to bring her dead boyfriend back to life also a bit of praise for people who follow the channel to find Prince Charming and get rich. Not long after, Diana met her long dead boyfriend at a ball. This moment she could not control the excitement and they embraced each other. She didn't think the crystal could really make a wish. That's when the leopard girl had a bold idea. This is a crystal that can make people's dreams come true. The leopard girl gripped the crystal and made a wish wish to have a sexy body, like Diana. Great power and a brush to the video of people's hearts. Waiting for the next day, she woke up to find that her eyes were no longer nearsighted with a perfect body. Even the body method has become perfect wherein high heels are very flexible. She easily pulled the refrigerator as a result of the door fell off. She came to the gym to easily lift dumbbells and then change a maximum size also effortlessly even a few hundred pounds of barbell can lift. The men were baffled. She came to the store to pick the sexiest dress that would show off her body completely. She came to the ball and she was the sexiest woman in the room and all eyes turned to her. Soon Maud comes onto her and the leopard girl has never felt this way before. Singo. She can't resist the temptation to be charmed by Rod. Rod's target is not her but the crystal that can fulfill the wish. He took advantage of this time to steal the crystal. It turns out that Rod is an oil developer who is trying to sell his oil on TV. When in fact the area has long since run out of oil, the partners decided to withdraw their investment and Rod was on the verge of bankruptcy. At this point, she has got the crystal that can grant wishes. She made a wish. I wish to be you. The dream stone. Then the crystal turned into ashes. A gust of wind hit Rod with all the power of God. Using the divine power, Rod obtained the shares and control of the company and called the IRS to investigate the original owner. At this time Diana found that the crystal was missing. She found the leopard girl to ask about the crystal. She learns from leopard woman that the crystal has been taken by Rod. Diana quickly rushed to Rod's office but found that Rod was not here. The boyfriend finds a ticket to iPaul on the floor, which means Rod has a right to iPaul. Since her boyfriend could not fly without a passport, they decided that she would fly the plane to iPaul. His boyfriend was a pilot and flying the plane was a piece of cake for him. Soon, the plane was launched successfully, but at that moment, they were discovered by the police on duty. The police were in hot pursuit of them. Diana had known the plane to launch the power of God. The plane instantly disappeared. The radar cannot search. At this time Rod has used the Wish and Oil Boss Exchange. She obtained more than half of the world's oil on the top of life. She was ready to find her next target. At that moment, Diana caught up with her in a cab. Rod initiated the order and the soldiers began to fire heavily. Diana finally couldn't resist. She put on her battle armor and ran up furiously. The soldiers were looking blind. She jumped to the car steering wheel just lost. At this point, a bullet was shot at her boyfriend. She rope flung to catch the bullet saved the boyfriend. Then, she pushed the truck to run wildly. Bullets were blocked by the truck. 
she killed the machine gunner with a lasso. There were people shooting behind her, Diana was shot, and she had to duck into the roof of the truck to avoid the bullets. The enemy was firing so hard that tires were flying out. The truck was about to come down and Diana exploded. She took the opportunity to jump in front of Rod's car and asked about the rock. But Rod told Diana, You're looking at it. She was shocked. Immediately afterwards, she was pinned down by two armored cars to avoid the bullets. She used all her strength to hold on hard, just when the armored car was going to crash over. Fortunately, her boyfriend arrived in time. At that moment, some children appeared in front of her. Diana told her boyfriend to launch the missile. The rope caught the missile and flew forward to successfully save the children. That's how Rod managed to escape a piece of crystal can fulfill people's wishes. Behind actually hides a terrible disaster. Wish fulfillment is a scam. She gives you what you want but wants to take away your most important things. He wants to stop this disaster will have to return the wish to the crystal. The leopard girl heard this news and immediately refused. She didn't want to return the wish. Diana did not want to return the wish either. She had been alone for over 60 years and did not want to part with her boyfriend. But her boyfriend advised her to return the wish because the most important thing in Diana's body is the divine power and the fulfillment of the wish led to the gradual weakening of her divine power. Randomly granting people's wishes has made the city chaotic. Right at this time in the planning of a larger conspiracy, he helped the president to fulfill a wish to appear more nuclear weapons than the Soviet Union. The price for granting the wish was that the president became his puppet so that Rod could use the messaging system to help grant wishes to people all over the world. Soon Diana arrives and captures Rod. He orders his subordinates to kill Diana and starts shooting at her like crazy. He waved the rope in his hand to block the bullets. Soon, Rod's subordinates were all killed. Rod was about to be captured when the panther girl came in order to prevent the wish from being taken back. He had to stop Diana. Diana, who was weak, was no match for the leopard woman. In the end, leopard woman and Rod escaped. The Soviet Union began to declare war on the United States because of the appearance of nuclear weapons. And the city was in chaos. Diana looked around the panicked people, silently made up her mind. She decided to give up her wish. Although she did not want to, she mustered the courage to say goodbye to her boyfriend and ran forward like a madman. The faster she ran, the faster her divine power was restored and the wounds were all healed. She summoned the rope to the sky and flew to wrap around the plane to take her to the clouds above. She learned to fly. Soon, she came to a place full of lightning. She took out the rope and grabbed the lightning and swung. Meanwhile, Rod had succeeded in getting people all over the world to make a wish. A great catastrophe occurred in the world. The man blurted out. Then the woman died. Some people wanted money. Some wanted to be king. And the world was in a panic. Diana took a shower and got ready to change into her brand new battle armor. Soon, she arrived at the signal transmitting base, easily defeating the defending soldiers. The leopard girl had once again wished to become more powerful. She was very fast. Wonder Woman was knocked away by her. She then launched a series of life-threatening attacks. Soon, Diana's battle armor could not withstand Leopard Woman's destruction. She had to drop the wings behind her no longer dodge ready to attack head-on. They began a battle in the air. Eventually, they accidentally fell into the water. Diana asked Leopard Woman one last time if she was willing to give up her wish. The Leopard Girl still answered firmly. Diana had to pull Leopard Woman into the water. The wire fell into the water and electrocuted Leopard Woman. She quickly rushed out of the water. Diana got the final victory. She arrived at the base only to find that Rod was still granting wishes. A powerful force made it difficult for Diana to move an inch. At this point Rod was very proud, but Diana has taken the opportunity to lock the truth lasso to his feet and then told the truth to the world. Everyone was impressed by Diana are willing to take back her wish. Just then, Rod sees his son in the chaos of the city, and the nuclear bomb is coming to the city. If Rod does not give up his wish, then his son will lose his life. Rod finally gave up his wish. Everything was then restored to its original state. What can really change everything is not power, nor charm, but people.